We're going we're gonna to start the show tonight with a game called Let's Make a Date. It's going to feature Greg Proops as somebody appearing on a dating programme. The other three, I'm afraid, are the possible dates for him. Uh, but to make it even more complicated, they've been allocated strange identities, which they can discover what those are by looking at these envelopes. And Greg can work out who they are just by what's said in the course of improvisation. And if he gets these right, well, he could easily win this game. So, <laughs> take it away, <laughs> Mr P. Thank you, Mr A. Number one, contestant number one. Hi. Hello. Hi. Uh, <laughs> I, I love to have fun, and I will fully put out if I have enough fun. <laughs> Where would you... What, secu what secluded place would you take me to have some fun? Cornwall. <laughs> Cornwall? Yes, anywhere. I own most of it. <laughs> All right. Uh, number two, hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. Hi, number two. Hi. Um, I, like I said, I like to have fun. Where would you take me? <laughs> oh, I would take you somewhere where you could be held by my strong, slender fingers, my muscular thighs bulging in anticipation at the very... What? <laughs> number three. Yeah. I'm still tripping on number two. Are you? Yeah. Are you indeed? Yeah, well, Isn't that nice? <laughs> tripping away. Big trip, huh? Like to some faraway country with a big bag of money. Is that what you're saying? Tripping away. <laughs> Maybe with another guy's wife. Wouldn't that be fun, huh? Where, where would you take me? I'd probably take you somewhere where the sound of a gun can be heard. <laughs> Number one, uh, I love to go to the country. Do you have a place in the country you would take me to? Oh, loads of them. <laughs> Anywhere you like. Okay. Uh, well, I, I always believe an Englishman's home is his castle. Well, most of mine are anyway. <laughs> Good. Number, number two. Yeah. Uh, I... Hello, foot. <laughs> Number three. What? Uh, um, mm. do you, <laughs> what's your favorite color? Red. Blood red. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you got these. Come on. Oh, I think I do, Clive. Yes. But you know how this goes. Yes. There's always the hope of me getting it and then the crushing disappointment of my actual <laughs> guess. It's usually disappointed with you, uh, Prince Charles? Yes. Is well, uh, yeah. Well, For those of you playing along at home, number two is quite a challenge. <laughs> a, a, a narcissistic guy? Yes, that's right. He's in love with everybody. Yes. Narcissist. Perfectly. Better way of describing it. And number three is a serial murderer of something? Oh, <laughs> so close. He's a former business partner you ripped off. But uh, there you are. Two out of three is not bad. Well done. George Washington. Okay. Okay. So two out of three there for Greg, and that's two points he gets.